Keep watching Charis TV. Uh, greetings. Uh, my name is uh, Prophet Wisdom from Alamlele. Uh, <coughs> my, my reason for coming to see the man of God for one-on-one -on -one was mainly because personally I was experiencing heaviness in my, uh, my prayer life. So uh, the man of God told me that there's an issue that I'm worried about. That's why it's I'm, I'm feeling very heavy. But uh, I should not worry about that issue. So when I saw, I saw him, he said, I must stand there. And then he prayed for me. Uh, when he was praying for me, uh, automatically I felt a bit numb. But I could feel in my spirit the way burning sensation in my stomach here. And what he told me was uh, I should not stop uh, preaching in the church until my father comes back and also uh, that no one else should preach in the church except for me until my father comes back uh, from his rest. So I really want to thank God for the grace that is in this place. Uh, so I'm very revived. I believe I'll be able to pray by the grace of God from today. I will no longer experience that heaviness. Uh, so I thank God. Uh, I would like to encourage uh, Christians uh, all over the world to come uh, and not also to to relax and neglect us the, their prayer life. You don't wait for a problem to come. Uh, prayer life is an indicator that devil can do anything. So if you can see that your prayer life is not uh, satisfactory or it's not where you want it to be, it's also a reason enough to see uh, the man of God or uh, see where God uh, can help you because our prayer is a, is a good determinant of what's happening in our spirit. So if you're not able to pray, I also advise you that you seek someone who can pray for you in order for you to pray. Like the Bible says, iron sharpen iron. So I believe that I would like to encourage people, don't wait for a problem. If you see your prayer life is not okay, seek prayer just for the prayer to come back. So that's my advice. God bless you.